feel that Gates did see something inside of me that maybe I didn't see in myself, but they saw that I, I am. I work hard and I do, and they saw that I have potential. I'm going to University of California, Los Angeles, UCLA, fight on, and um, I'm gonna study physiological sciences uh, on my way, on my journey to trying to become a neurosurgeon. You know the saying, to whom much is given, much is expected. So I will work really hard to, to show that I did deserve this scholarship, that I did deserve to get this blessing. Because a lot of people can't even go to college because of money. You know, I love helping people. That's why I got into the whole field of medicine. I love medicine. I, I used to watch medical programs all the time. And it, it, it really inspired me because, you know, and I had a lot of people who been telling me since I was about five years old, oh, I see you being becoming a surgeon. I'm the youngest of five brothers. Um, I come from a single parent household. Yeah, my mom did a really good job of keeping me uh, grounded. Uh, she, she always told me little things like, Amir, don't do this, don't do that, do do this, do do that. And I really paid attention to her words and she really, she helped me and she blessed me. I had to do something for my mom that was really special and I had to do this for my mom. So I worked really hard and that's why I'm in the position I am today as the youngest, bringing this, uh, this glory to our family and it feels good. Me and Louisa and David, we built a robotic arm that was supposed to grab space debris. And it was those programs that kind of got me interested in science a little bit more. The staff is not bad here at Dominguez. They're exceptional. The teachers are great. They're awesome. My teachers were great and awesome. And they guided me. They helped me. They took me under their wing. My counselor, Ms. Shabazz, Compton is a very good city. It's full of smart kids who just want to become successful. Academically, you can make it even if you're from Compton. And I'm just, I'm glad to be that person to set an example for the underclassmen and the kids growing up in Compton to see that, yes, you can make it no matter what you do. If you put your mind to it, you can break social barriers and you can break any chain that is holding you back as long as you work for it and uh, have a little bit of faith.